Artificial intelligence AI is a wide-ranging branch of computer science concerned with building smart machines capable of performing tasks that typically require human intelligence. While AI is an extensive and comprehensive science with multiple approaches, advancements in machine learning and deep learning in particular are creating a paradigm shift in virtually every tech industry sector. Hello everyone, I'm Avantika Kansal and you're watching New India Junction. India has started preparing itself and also the world in this upcoming field of AI as it chaired the GPAI Global Partnership on Artificial Alliance Summit from 12th to 14th of December 2023 in Delhi. The GPI has 29 member nations that include EU, European Union as one of the 29. The inaugural address at the summit was given by none other than Prime Minister Modi who effectively laid down the vision for this new and upcoming technology. Global Partnership on Artificial Intelligence Summit the Prime Minister welcomed everyone and mentioned how there is a huge debate all around the world about AI. There are hopes but there are fears too. He mentioned how AI is already touching the lives of all, be it young or not so young. His address made a resounding stress on the alignment of universal human values with AI so that it can be made to work for the good of all. The PM focused on how India is already emerging as the most prominent player in the AI talent and also producing new ideas relating to it. He mentioned meeting brilliant young minds at the AI Expo and how he was impressed and overjoyed. He also mentioned the AI chatbot for agriculture. It will keep farmers updated about government schemes and their status vis-a-vis -vis those schemes. His vision also entailed how AI could help achieve SDGs sustainable development goals. In alignment with Sabka Saad Sabka Vikas, the government's policies regarding AI and its trajectory are inspired by the mantra AI for all. The intention is to aim for social development and inclusive growth through AI. The government has already launched a national program on artificial intelligence and is working on the soon to be launched AI mission in Bharat. The AI mission aims to achieve adequate computational power in the country. This will enable startups and innovators while also helping arrest brain drain. The Eravat Initiative, a common AI platform for all, will help all the research labs, industries and startups in the nation. The National AI Portal will help promote AI initiatives in the country and the industrial training institutes will take AI skills to the Tier 2, Tier 3 cities. This will make sure that no one is left behind. The PM is stressed on the use of AI for inclusive development that enables and empowers all and stated how the last century was one of growing inequalities because of unequal access to technology. The proper utilization of AI technology could help neutralize that. He thus stated that AI vision must be driven by humans and democratic values and not just profit. He expounded how AI can make us more effective but it is up to us to maintain our ethical standards and make sure that is used for the good for all. AI must be used for social justice and achieving a better society. He insightfully said, we know that when democratic values are combined with technology, it works as a multiplier towards inclusion. He also spoke of the three T's, transformative, transparent and trusted. No doubt that the tech has transformative potential. But it is up to us to make sure that the algorithms are transparent and free of biases. TCP system को sustainable बनाने के लिए उसे transformative, transparent और trusted बनाना पड़ता है. He led out a vision where people are convinced that AI is for everyone's good and would not harm them. At the same time, he also warned how the potential negative aspects of AI are of equal concern. The challenge of deep fake cyber security threats, issue of data access, and most importantly, the danger of bad players like terrorists getting access to this powerful technology were highlighted in the address. Responsible human-centric AI governance was thus an important part of the G20 discussions as well. He encouraged innovators to think how AI can responsibly be implemented in transparent decision-making, helping increase employment, encourage language diversity, which is India's special strength and digital inclusion. He also made a special remark on how we Indians could use AI to reclaim our fragmented ancient literature, which we prize and can help add immense value to humanity, book 
of knowledge. This is an exciting time as we get to see our novel technology unfold right in front of our eyes. But as the PM said, containing it is also quite critical. Well, that's it for today's video. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe to New India Junction. This is Avantika Kansal signing off. Until next time.